15 love. Because we know what he can do with the backhand right there. Again, that's a counter. There's the break. So when it was time for me to kind of maybe put my eggs in a basket, um, it was tennis and I was already playing catch up, to be honest with you. So I had to put so much energy and time into just trying to figure the tennis piece out. But I do understand. Beautiful again, forehand by Reed. But the cross training is an exceptional way for many of these athletes to just clear their head from, from their main sport. Somebody's much like, enjoying the, joy, that much like the joy of that young lady you're hoisting a little chocolate ice cream. <laughs> oh, that is terrific. Lovely. Yeah, as you, you talked about earlier, both of these guys being such amazing and accomplished doubles players, there's an, a lot of that has to do with their doubles games and how often they're going forward when they play doubles. Trying to take lumps out of the other on court here with the firepower they possess. You know, these guys are all court players personified. Oh. Oh. Wow. How has he made that? Well, it's the shot from Reed to start it off that puts him in the corner. We're tracking it down. Watch this return of serve right here. That action, that's 99.9% .9 winner, and that's why he gets the applause there. That's magical. Oh, that's a brutal return. Took it early. That's going to be a tough day against a guy like Alfie Hewitt. Now here he is for the break back. 15-40. Before and since for this man. Yeah, got his first Australian this year. Down under. And he's got his first break of serve there. He repairing the damage of losing his serve early on. Yeah, looking comfortable again, finding the range now. Once that guy gets on a roll. Yeah, he's starting to find the winners. Yeah, when he's got the fist pump going regularly, bad news for opponents on the other side of the net. We're going to see one right here. There it is. The internal flame is starting to burn a little hot. Oh, oh. well, hold on. Gordon, like, you know, <laughs> you couldn't hit some magical shots, but man, look at the acceleration on that backhand. That is at the top, way above the shoulders and still able to drive that shot. A few more punches to the nose. <laughs> Doesn't get much better than that. The shoulder of his opponent. And there's no doubt there was a, a bigger emphasis from Reed in that whole game to be a little bit more aggressive, even with the miss or two. He kind of set a tone there. There's the big backhand, right? Yeah. that up and again above the shoulders much like the one we saw from Reed a little
Oh, too good. Exquisite angle from Reed. Hard to predict where he's going to go. I mean, it's just the, the quick movement of the chair at the end. He can open up and bring that cross court or stay in that position like he did right there. Drive that ball inside out. In this moment right here, hand loose being the real key, I think. No nonsense return. Yeah, no way back. The art of the game. Fabulous finish again himself pumped up out there yeah it kind of looks like he's asking himself where has that been i mean why am i not being able to re nice response again comfortable state from the start right here today and look at the tranquility in his game right there that, that back wheel starts to spin more freely. Oh, that is inspired. Boy, we've seen a couple of these now from Hewitt. One down the line before this one. Big, arching, top spin, short angle, everything. Sensing he's a... A huge yeah, tussle yeah. for this and opening set, set. goes 16, the way of Hewitt ball. and a fourth double fault seals the deal for him. Avoiding that pitfall. Lightning strikes yeah, twice. Yeah. Uh, calm and comfortable, and, and Alfie's kind of been up, down, up, down, a little bit erratic today. He's been more explosive in pretty much every aspect. Oh, seriously good point. Where he was in the corner of the court, look at this. On the run, yeah. But he was waiting with a pretty ruthless finish mm -hmm. in the forecourt. I think he feels like he could probably have the advantage in those exchanges. Oh. Almost feel like he's spending a little too much time with his box right now. Just cross over the hour mark. Oh. Game Hewitt. Oh, <laughs> yes, little tap of joy right there, Gordon Reed. So much action with the hand there at the end, and that was something that Gordon's dealt with in the past is some wrist injuries. And now that he thinks he's completely healthy, it makes... Love 15. Get the edge here. Battle. Yeah, it could be a shark starting to smell a little bit of blood in the water. It's still early here in the second, but it is the second, and Alfie has one in the bag already. That's just fabulous. Indeed. <laughs> yeah. It's nice to have that luxury right there. Gordon Reed is wishing he'd chip that down the line now, I would think. 
on return. You'll feel better about the forehand after that. Snaffily get a little smile. Like you see here with Alfie, it's oftentimes going laterally that they struggle a little bit more with their forehands. But right there, he can drive through that. Backhand again delivers. Then pounces right here with the first opportunity he has. Smash a backhand down the line. He's playing. Oh. Terrific pick up from Reed. Oh. Effortless brilliance on the forehand. There, and I like it. I like it. It's exactly what needs to come as a response to a shot like that. It's big. No way back Can after that. New and a roar face. at the other end of the court. Hewitt Lee. Waiting return. Yes. Gordy went for the big first, but it's Alfie with the big return there that earns the break for two. The lad from Norwich. More good news, good news, really, isn't it? It is. Yeah, in the big picture, it is. They will be coaches of a Grand Slam champion. One way or another. Well, making absolutely certain up at the net, but Gordon Reed. Yeah, I think Alfie has really got a sense of the finish line right now, and he is going to look to put all sorts of pressure on Gordon, and it's going to take a Herculean effort from Gordon Reed if he can claw his way back into this match. Oh, hold on. There's always that. Start to finish there. Better approach with the serve. And then no hesitation here on the backhand. I think that approach is something that Gordon The backhand. He's well into double digits. On the backhand winners for the match, just tell. Not yet. What a time to go to that. to basics with his first strike tennis almost home now there is a body serve just bored in on Gordy all he could do to get it back but of course Alfie in such a great position just clean that up <laughs> Alfie Hewitt is the king of wheelchair tennis in New York again it's back-to-back -back titles for him, and he achieves it at the expense of his great friend and doubles partner, Gordon Reed. An eighth singles Grand Slam title for him, and a wonderful performance. It was a battle. We knew it would be.
a gritty British battle. And in the end, he is the one who claims the title and can start to celebrate a fourth US Open title.